Ladies and gentlemen, Thompson's Coins, I'm still here. I'm still active on YouTube. It's just been an incredibly busy time in the shop. Let me give you the details. So opening day was an absolute hit. I couldn't have been happier about it. It was so nice to see so many friendly and familiar faces down. We even had guests all the way from Bendigo. For those that are interstate or overseas, that's an incredibly long trip. So it was a big hit. It was really, really exciting. I told my wife that it would be nice. I would be satisfied if we had 10 or 15 people show up because as far as I'm concerned, that's a crowd. If you've got 10 people in a small shop like this, that's an event. So you can only imagine my surprise and excitement when we had over 100 people show up. So it was really, really cool to see so many collectors of all ages, truly of all ages. You know, I think my daughter may have been, oh no, there was a few other little babies there. So from little babies right up to the older crowd, everyone seemed to really enjoy it. And it's, it's a really interesting concept. And I like to, I often speak in analogies or metaphors Often musicians say that you work so hard on a piece of music and then when you put it out there, it no longer belongs to you. It's now for everyone. And I actually feel that in a big way with this shop. I've spent so much time, months and months and months on it. And now it's no sort of no longer mine. It's, it's for the community, it's for the collectors. And it's been really well received. And for that reason, I couldn't be happier. All the, all the hard work has paid off, but in a lot of senses, now that the shop's open, I have to film videos like this uh, outside of hours, and that's proven to be incredibly difficult between daycare pickups and drop offs and all the other things that I get up to. I'll be in Perth next month for the Ander show. So, between all of those things, I still want to try and make time to do videos and hopefully give some insight as to what's going on with the business. And also, I want to continue to produce educational content because Ultimately, that's what you can do here in the shop. You can come on in and that's been super rewarding. Having people come in that just have uh, maybe a passing interest, they've wandered in and I've given them a little tour and explained some of the historic items that I've got on display here. And it's always really, really exciting when people say, this is almost part shop and part museum. And I think that's exactly what I was going for. And the hope is that people can come in here and see the importance of currency for, I guess, all humans. You can really travel from ancient times. I've got coins from Alexander the Great here, right through to the proclamation period of Australia's currency history. Um, I've, I've even got a little wall here with some information. I won't give it away just yet. Maybe you'll have to come in and see, but I've got a little wall here that gives a brief overview of the history of currency in Australia. So the idea behind the shop is obviously it's a retail space and this is a business. So I hope that it can continue to be a thriving business, but I also want it to be a place where collectors can come and just chat about coins and learn a little bit as well. So if you've got a particular interest and it's something that I know about, I'm always happy to share the information. Otherwise, if it's something that I maybe don't know a lot about, I'm always happy to go away and source the information, find out, and then we can have an interesting conversation. So that's it for now. I just wanted to sort of check in, let you know that I'm still here, but that it's becoming incredibly difficult to make regular videos. For instance, the other day someone came into the shop and they said, oh, I tried to call you twice and you didn't answer. And there was maybe 10 people in the store and I had to say, well, <laughs> have a look around you. If, I, if I'm not here, uh, I can't currently be answering the phone and emails are banking up, voicemails are banking up. It's, it's a whole new lesson in business management. I thought it was quite time consuming at times running an online coin shop. A physical store is a totally different beast and I'm sure there are many business owners that are watching this nodding away saying, yes, you see now, Matt, this isn't you know, a simple thing. People often think that I would just come in, open the door and everything would, would work. It's not like that at all. Everything is far more complicated and difficult than I had ever imagined. Similarly though, this whole process has been far more rewarding than I thought possible. Getting to interact with so many different collectors that are so receptive to the shop and so appreciative that I've gone to these lengths, I've really, really 
put it all out there and done my absolute best. And to have that um, received in such a positive way by the community, I couldn't have possibly asked for more. So it's, it's been the absolute best. So this video is basically just a thank you to anyone who attended the grand opening, anyone who has come into the store. I apologize if the service has been a little slow. I'm doing my best to keep up and you know work my way around some of the antiquated technology that I use. But moving forward, it'll only get better and I look forward to you know sharing the greatest hobby in the world with even more people as time goes on. So that's it for now. Please subscribe to the channel if you want to keep in the loop with what's going on with the business and what I'm getting up to in the great world of collecting. And I'll see you soon. Thank you all for coming along to help us celebrate the opening of our first ever physical shop. The process for opening a shop has proven to be infinitely more complicated than I had envisioned. And it would have been impossible had it not been for the support of my amazing wife who, despite being very logical, pragmatic and level-headed, has somehow supported me in this crazy venture of opening a physical coin shop here in Baronia. This really is a family business too. My brother has done all of the construction work on the store, mum has been up here cleaning non-stop, dad has given us invaluable advice and guidance, and my lovely mother-in-law has also been down from Sydney helping us with preparations too. And I'm sure you'll be seeing more of my siblings helping out as this journey continues. I've been an avid collector since I was a young child and always love sharing the passion of collecting with like-minded individuals. Collecting is something that extends to all ages and all walks of life and it's, and it's that broad appeal which has allowed me to meet so many fascinating people. This shop represents the culmination of a 10 plus year career in the industry and I can't wait to share it with all of you. Welcome to Thompson's Coins. <laughs> And we can cut it. You, you hold my it. hand. I've got Ruthie, you go for it. I'll get rid of that. Yeah. Ta-da! Yeah. <laughs> we're open! We are open! Yeah.